You just found a baby bird on the ground. What do you do now? Take it home? No, don't be a bird napper. Most baby birds that people find are fledglings, which means they can hop around, they have a bunch of feathers. They might still have some pin feathers, some little baby feathers, but they're mostly looking like adults and they're hopping around. Those are fledglings. Leave those alone. Mama and daddy are around the area and they'll feed fledglings for two weeks or more in order to help them become adults. Nestlings should not be out of the nest. So nestlings have few or no feathers and can barely control their heads. If you can see the nest, just gently take the baby and put it right back in there. Won't the parents smell my scent on it and peck the baby's face off or kill it somehow? No, most birds don't have a very good sense of smell at all, except for like turkey vultures and stuff. You could eat a garlic pizza and lick that baby bird. You could rub that baby bird all across your dog's booty. And they'll still take it back. But please don't do either one of those things. Now here's the Redwood Rising Forest Restoration Project twist. We don't start our heavy restoration, bringing out our heavy equipment and our chainsaws and all that stuff to help restore the forest, help the forest heal itself until after the majority of the bird nesting season is over. So we don't even go into the woods until June 15th. Redwood Rising, the type of forest restoration we do, brings this light back in. So the light increases the plant diversity, which increases the insect diversity. And remember, insects are like the plankton of the land, so that increases the bird diversity and the small mammal diversity and the fish diversity, because fish eat insects too. Like I said, insects are the plankton of the land. If the bird's injured or definitely orphaned, like you're sure it's orphaned, use the Animal Help Now app. It's free, you can download it to your phone, and it connects you to local wildlife rehabbers fast. So remember, don't be a bird napper. Be a bird backer. Help birds. We can also help them. Redwood Rising does. If you want to learn more about how we do it, go to redwoodsrising.org. I do it. My name's Griff. You can find out a lot of the different conservation things I'm doing by going to griffgriffith.info.